Hello. Now we will continue with the presentation of the features of Hepatic VCAR software. Hepatic VCAR is a CT image analysis software designed to assist the user in providing initial 3D segmentation, vessel analysis, visualization, and quantitative analysis of liver anatomy. In this video, we will present the segment separation features of Hepatic VCAR. We will continue from the point where we stopped in the prior tutorial video. For more information about the previous steps, please refer to Hepatic VCAR Part 1. After accepting the liver segmentation, the user has the option to continue with the analysis by separating the liver into segments or lobes. Hepatic VCAR provides two methods for this type of segmentation portal vein-based segment separation and virtual scalpel-based segment separation. We will start with virtual scalpel. In this example, we will separate the liver into left and right lobe and the left lobe into two segments. Using the same view, we need to define at least three traces in the liver to define each of the segments or virtual surgery that we wish to simulate. To define each trace, left click on Define Virtual Cut and then click and hold on the left mouse button to apply the virtual cut. Remember that the software needs at least three traces, but we can add more if we want to enhance results. Clear Trace and Clear All will assist user in trace editing. To perform the segment separation, press Apply. Review the segment separation. If you wish to edit, right-click over an active yellow segment and select Unlock. The editing process is similar to the one used before, including the possibility to interpolate superior, inferior or both. When satisfied with the segmentation, click on Accept and Measure. We will now carry out the second separation using the coronal plane as a reference. We can apply MIP to the images to help us to define the anatomy better. Remember that you can always clear trace if you want to change your trace. Once satisfied with the trace, click Apply. Right-clicking over an active segment will give you access to the ROI and volume options, such as label volume, change in the colour, etc. In this case, we will label the right lobe and segments 2 and 3. Please note that this is just an example and anatomy segmentation may not be entirely precise. Clicking protocol card Segments ID, the user has the capability to merge and display the segments or separations as desired. 
In this case, we will merge segments 2 and 3 to display the results for the left hepatic lobe. The user then has the options to show the results for the segments or the combination by selecting Show Segments. The result of the new segmentations will be added to the summary table along with the lesions and the liver selected in prior step. Statistics include volume and tumour burden. We can add more measurements under right click. To save results from the summary table, we can select between the format of a screen capture or a comma-separated value data file. Under Screen Capture, we can select the type of screen capture and the destination. Once saved, it will be available as a new series in the Patient folder. Remember to refresh the Workless browser so that the new reports will be shown. We can review the results in the 2D viewer. We can also export the data to the PACS or other archive destinations. Thanks for viewing. In the next tutorials, we will cover portal vein segment separation mode and VR compare.